Tonight on GDS, we are kicking off a summer reading week with two awesome giveaways, plus a new Let's Try It, all about taking a nap. Oh, it's a good day, stay Hello and welcome to Good Day State Line. Thanks so much for being here tonight. It is Monday, July 11th. Hope you had a great weekend. Today is National Swimming Pool Day. Do you have the coolest pool in the State Line? We would love to see it. Send us your epic pool pics on the Good Day State Line Facebook page, or you can always send us an email to at gds at fox39.com. We have a great show for you tonight. This week is Summer Reading Week. We have some awesome giveaways all week long for readers of all ages. Plus, we have a new Let's Try It. It will put you in the mood to read or to take a nap. We'll get to that a little later. But before we get to that, it is time for Insta Chat. Every night we're breaking down the latest trending Hollywood stories. Here and inside our Instagram story, kicking things off tonight with an interesting potential twist in the Johnny Depp Amber Heard trial. You knew we weren't done hearing about this, right? <laughs> so get this. Amber's legal team filed new legal documents on Friday claiming the wrong person served on the jury so the judge should declare a mistrial. So what do they mean the wrong person? Well, according to these documents, Amber's team says an unidentified 77-year-old living at an address in Virginia was summoned to jury duty, but that person didn't show up. Instead, an unidentified 52-year-old living at the exact same address with the same last name showed up instead and ended up as one of the jurors on the Depp vs. Heard trial. Is this grounds for a mistrial? I don't really know. I suppose it could be. I'm positive, though, we will hear more about this and we'll let you know. Also trending tonight, Miles Teller might as well fire his agent. His grandma is busy <laughs> working him into some new roles. She is working for him on Twitter. Miles' grandma, her name is Leona Flowers, has decided that her grandson should be the next James Bond. So she's telling everyone about it. So on June 29th, she began the campaign for Miles, tweeting, Quote, they're looking for an actor to replace Daniel Craig for future 007 movies. I think my grandson, Miles Teller, has proven that he has everything they're looking for. Talent, looks, strength, worldwide appeal, and oh so cool. He can be that guy. Wouldn't he be great? So that was her first tweet. The first of 10, you can see what she had to say once Fan mentioned uh, that he's not British inside the Good Day State Line Instagram story. And if you didn't already love Paul Rudd, you will after this story. For real though, I almost cried watching this video. There's this boy named Brody whose mom Cassandra posted on social media that she was heartbroken after her son had only two signatures in his yearbook uh, this year and that he wrote himself a note in the book saying that I hope you make some more friends. She shared that he's really intellectual and kids in his age group have trouble relating to him. He gets teased all the time and it just broke her heart. So not only did students uh, see this message on social media, older students than Brody sent him messages after his mom posted this, but Paul Rudd saw the story too. FaceTime Brody in what might be the cutest video I've ever seen. After the FaceTime, he sent him a handwritten note and a gift package. Now they're text message buddies. You can see the video right now inside our story too, along with our bonus interest story tonight. Serena Williams and her daughter celebrating afternoon uh, tea week in London. You want to check that out. Shout out to Dan, the newest member of the GDS Mug Society. So check this out. This is Dan's dog, Vinny, on the mug. It's so cute. So Dan brought us this and he told us a little bit about Vinny, that Vinny was an abused little guy and dropped off at Paul and since having him he's gained a following of over 3,700 followers on Instagram and he has a great life now. We are big Vinny fans too. Thanks Dan for bringing us a Vinny mug. You can bring us a mug too. You can be part of the GDS Mug Society. Just drop it off here anytime at the station. We'll swap you for some GDS swag. Get more details at GoodDayStateLine.com. We'll be right back with a sneak peek at the trendy backpacks your kids will love when they head back to school.